thanks with a grateful heart. Give thanks to the Holy One. Give thanks because He's given Jesus Christ, His Son. Greetings, everyone. I trust you are doing well with the Lord. I am. Praise be to God. I'm grateful for that. Behind me today, I have a picture of azaleas from China. We're talking like miles and miles and miles long of blooming azaleas, shaw's gorgeous, and so many different colors too. Aren't they lovely? Lovely, lovely. That is God. Our God is a lovely God. He creates all these beautiful things for us to enjoy. The symbolic meaning of azalea flowers are passion and womanhood. Fun fact. All right, let's go ahead and get started with today's word with Joel and Victoria. The scripture is from 2 Kings 4, 16 NIV. About this time next year, Elisha said, you will hold a son in your arms. The name of this devotional is The One Thing Missing. In 2 Kings 4, there was a well-to-do lady who had a nice house and influential friends, but she was barren and her husband was old. Whenever the prophet Elijah traveled through their town, she graciously provided him with a room and food. One day, God gave Elisha the desire to bless this woman with the one thing missing in her life. And within a year, she was holding her baby boy. What she thought was too good to be true became a reality. God knows how to put desires in people's hearts to be good to you. You keep doing the right thing, honoring God, and he'll line up the right people to help you. God is a supernatural God. He created the universe. He can make things happen that seem too good to be true. Take the limits off God. He has blessings and provisions for the dreams that you've given up on. The business, the healing, the freedom from your addiction. About this time next year is a promise for you. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you so much that you are our almighty God who makes what seems too good to be true a reality. You've done it with this woman. And Father, we trust and know that you will do it in and through us. Father, we will continue to believe in your promises the heart's desires that you've put on us will come to pass. Thank you. I believe that you are doing something right now behind the scenes and you, were, you will reward us for all that we are doing, Lord, being submissive and obedient to you, doing your will, not complaining, but just following you and delighting in you. And you will bless us. Thank you. We receive your word today. We honor you, Lord, and we will take it and we will use it. In Jesus' precious and holy name we pray. Amen and amen. Until tomorrow, toikin.